Okay, very, very, very quick tutorial on how to export your own prefab. Um, Cam has made this jungle gym boxing prefab, and so I want to export it. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to go over to one corner. First of all, I want to check and see if there's anything underneath, so I don't have to worry about lower levels. That's good. Okay, I'm going to stand at a corner here. I'm going to go to console. I'm going to type LOC for location. I'm going to go to the opposite corner. I'm going to fly up in the air until my feet are higher than the highest block. So I'm going to overkill it by going over quite a bit. And I'm going to type BC export um, boxing ring, boxing gym. That sounds good. Oh, that's what I'm going to call it. And that's it. That's all you have to do to export it. What that does is that saves the prefab file in my prefab folder. And now if I wanted to, I can come over here. Boop, 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 boop. Let me just teleport, get far enough away. <clears throat> If I wanted to, I could type BC import boxing gym, and then now I'm starting to buy a boxing gym. It's that simple. Um, one tool I wanted to show you guys real quick was a clearing tool. Let's say you just needed a lot cleared. So you come over, you find a spot, you're like, man, this is enough room. This should be fine, right? So all I'm going to do is I'm going to stand in the middle, make sure there are no POIs around me. F1, BC, dash, import. And it's going to be 20 x 20 air for 20 by 20 air. Look at that. Now i got a 20 by 20 prefab air. So hopefully that will help you guys with your prefabs. Oh, if you make a mistake on something, you can go to BC, dash, import, and then undo and it puts it back. So that way if you accidentally fuck up something and you, hit and you kill somebody else's or your own prefab, you can always fix it. 